Welcome to our podcast, Self-Awareness. I'm Tony Cubica with Cubica LaForest Consulting's BizSense Media to Grow the Business Mind. This podcast is about self-awareness, the personal requisite for performance improvement. Many professionals we know strive to improve their individual performance in their career position. And a question we often get from executives and entrepreneurs we coach is, what's the most important thing to do to ensure that I grow professionally and advance in my career? Our answer is self-awareness is core to performance improvement. Now, that's not often what business leaders expect to hear. They expect to hear things like skill building, taking on new responsibilities, and how these are core to performance improvement. So why does self-awareness lead? It leads for three reasons. First, you need to be aware of your strengths and attributes as other people see them. Not as you think you see them, but as other people actually see them. And second, and equally important, you need to be aware of your deficits and challenge areas. These are also known as derailment potential, behaviors that can take you off your game. And third, you need to recognize what's most important to you personally about your career experience. Simply developing new knowledge and skills may not be applicable to your growth. And the common default of doing nothing differently will certainly result in more of the same, thereby promoting mediocrity and potentially entropy. Yet self-awareness is a vulnerable position, and that's why so many struggle with it. It's pretty easy and fun to identify and recognize your strengths and all the things you're good at. What's far more challenging is to understand and work to manage and improve your deficits, particularly as others see them and experience them. Now, to be clear on what we mean by deficits, we're talking about behaviors such as interrupting people in the middle of their conversation, not listening to the people in front of you, being condescending in meetings. These are annoying behaviors and behaviors that can hold you back from achieving your career advancement goals. Yes, we really do mean that poor interrelationship skills can prevent your next promotion. Do you know that one of the reasons that inhibit growth in startups and that prevent reinvention of existing businesses is the ego of the leader? An ego that the leader doesn't acknowledge or perhaps doesn't even recognize. How often do people really delve into self-exploration and objectively, through evidence-based methods, identify and learn to balance these potential deficits and unintended self-destructive behaviors. We find less than more. This is all part of self-awareness, and self-awareness is a leadership attribute and a feeder to growth. So where do you start? You start with your own reflection and candid assessment. Unfortunately, this is also where most people end. But you need to go one step further. You need to engage a trusted advisor. That could be a mentor, it could be a coach, or it could be a trusted friend who's willing and able to be candid with you. A trusted advisor to add insights to your behavior and how it is likely to affect others. And finally, they can provide advice on what you can do now to improve and grow. Many we've met say they are self-aware yet they don't align themselves to the company and to the opportunities that give them the greatest likelihood for success. And others claim self-awareness, yet do nothing to balance areas where they can improve. Or worse, justify their behavior by saying, I know, it's just the way I am. We believe this is hubris, delusional, or simply a lack of caring about not being their best or not caring about their impact on others. So in closing to today's podcast, one question for you is, how truly self-aware are you? And what are you doing about it? For more help with key issues and topics on business growth, leadership, branding, and culture, visit our blog, www.yourbusinessgyroscope.com.
And for free articles, white papers, videos, and podcasts, see our website, www.cubicleofforestconsulting.com. Thanks for joining us. BizSense, media that grows the business mind.